How's it going everyone? Equinox Phoenix here. Today we're going to talk about Stargirl Season 1, Episode 11, titled Shining Night. <sighs> this episode is um, a bit of a doozy. As we know, last episode, um, Henry King Jr. was killed by his father. <laughs> and there goes this video being seen by anyone. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have brought that up first thing. <laughs> anyway. But, since we're in the deep end now. Anyway, so yeah, it covers... Uh, last episode, Henry King Jr. died. This episode... Deals with not only the fallout of... Brainwave killing his kid. <sighs> But Courtney finally meets her father, Sam Curtis, who she's at first unbelieving, and then slowly it's proven to her that he is her father, and <sighs> unfortunately her father is a grade A asshole. <laughs> He cons her out of the necklace that she's always wearing under the pretense of ah oh, you will do it to put a down payment on a home and whatnot and it's eh. unfortunately Courtney sees right through it and or fortunately I guess uh, Courtney sees right through it and so when she goes inside and sees Pat she's on the verge of tears she ends up crying like, she hugs Pat and cries. Obviously, you know, when you find out your father isn't a dead hero, but actually an asshole willing to con his own daughter. It's kind of heartbreaking. Uh, it really is. We also find out, now of course, Pat doesn't take too well to, sorry, I was about to skip. Pat doesn't take too well to, um, Sam doing what he did. And so he goes to tell Sam, don't come back. Sam says, uh, Sam says something that I, I will not repeat. Not that it's, I just don't want to repeat it. Uh, it's kind of dickish to say, so I just won't repeat it. Um, but it causes Pat to punch him in the face and walk away. As a result of Sam being Sam, the staff no longer responds to Courtney due to her own insecurities. It's simply that. It's just no longer confident in herself and via a combination of conversations with her parents i.e barbara and pat even though pat's her stepfather she gains the confidence to regain access to the staff as it were. uh i can't think of a better word but the episode does end with... Wait, no, does it end with that? No, there's actually... Okay. So it doesn't end literally right there. Um, and of course, we have the title character of this episode. Justin, or Shining Knight. I don't know his last name. I guess I can look that up right now. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry, girl. His last name is not listed. <clears throat> okay, so, um, Shining Knight, aka Justin, um, Justin, um, goes to meet Pat because he realizes that Stripesy, Pat, is his only hope of regaining lost memories. After, now, of course, it 
he's not fully there in the head due to I guess him being tortured. Uh, I guess by what seems to be Doctor Ito. Um, now when Courtney regains use, uh, usage uh, is probably a better word. Usage of the staff. Um, he says something interesting. Our queen has risen. Or arisen. I don't know which one. He calls Courtney a queen. Now, I'm curious where they're going with that. Like, is Courtney about to be declared, like, literal royalty? Like, she gonna get some cool superpower out of it, or what? <laughs> but, yeah. Now, on the flip side, in the ISA's uh, thing, Brainwave has his memories back. Brainwave sends out a challenge to Courtney. And Jordan, aka Icicle, have has learned that Barbara is aware, as it were. And the episode ends with a countdown timer. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, it's 12 hours on the timer. 12 hours, 40 something minutes, and a couple seconds, and you know, seconds that are flashing quickly. Uh, and it shows Brainwave's access to the thing is essentially the middle half of the United States. So we'll say roughly both the mountain and central time zones. Which is interesting, you know. I'm curious if I'm curious if uh, their plan will succeed, and then it'll be undone. Like, how are they gonna work it? Um, who knows? Anyway, I guess that's. Uh, ooh, oof. I guess that's for um, another day. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this video. Tell me, guys, what you thought of the episode down in the comment section down below. If you guys haven't already, hit like, hit subscribe if you're new. I will see you guys next week. And as always, stay bright.